architecture. You obviously think it's important, but what about the general public? What do they think about it? Who's your favourite Australian architect? I have no idea. Architect. See, no, Siebel, some, some name, no, sorry. No, I don't know. <laughs> no, <laughs> no. Lyndon Johnson built the Cotton On building and uh, I think perhaps the Tarakash building as well. How many Australian architects can you name? None. Can you, none? Can you name one? Can you name any Australian architects? No. Not one at all. No. Can you? No. What about Mr Kelly from Hey Dad? Who's that? Run out of milk in the fridge, Mr Kelly. Nudge! <laughs> That's before our time. What do you think the most important professions are? IT. Got to say a doctor and a dentist. Politics. Teaching. Plumbers. Trades. All trades. Rugby players. Family care. A doctor and a nurse. Okay, this sounds like schmarchitects. Starts with an A. Architects. Arch so you think they're important? No. Architecture? What's an architect? <laughs> <laughs> that like got dinosaurs out of the ground and isn't that an architect? <laughs> what about like uh, architects? No. 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 Hairdressing definitely. Makeup artists. Tattooing. Uh, stripping. Do you think architects are important? Uh, not particularly, no. What do you think of architects? <laughs> They're legends mate, we love them. I think I saw a hint of sarcasm in that voice there. They're not practically minded, they think everything looks good. Architects are a pain in the ass. Oh, they're alright, as long as you keep them under control, they like spending money, mate. They want to do it quick, they want to do it real quick and bugger everything else. They just draw it on a bloody, you know, on a plan, on a computer, and then they actually go outside and, you know, and check what the bloody hell's going on out there, so... It gives me the shits. <laughs> if you were to give an architect a tip, what would it be? To quit their job, get a better one. Um, get a bit of practical experience on the job, on a work site, on a building site. All right, if you had some architecture students, the hypothetical group of architecture students sitting in front of you, what would you say to them? Go out and research you know, your design before you actually put it out there and make someone build it. I think you should add your twits at the end of that. Your twits. So if you've got bad architects with ugly buildings. So what is an ugly building then? Uh, I wasn't overly impressed with the one on the other end of Victoria Square. Federal law courts, I think, isn't it? I reckon that law court building looks like pretty ugly. Do you think that there are any horrendous buildings in Adelaide? Um, your house, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the old spotlight building? <laughs> Probably some of the ones at Adelaide Uni, I'd say. Uh, the Schultz building, yeah, definitely. At yeah, Adelaide Uni, yeah. Definitely the ugliest phallic symbol in Adelaide. Yeah, the Santos building. Law court building? So the court, yeah. It's bad memories. Bad memories, yeah. Lost a couple of kids there. <laughs> sure. The, uh, the Supreme Court building, the one they've done, that's pretty ugly. Law courts. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the verdict is out. You have told us the law buildings suck. The law courts suck. Aren't they disgusting? Aren't they a shame? I'm fine. Are you fired up? It looks like a giant cheese cater grater. This is crap. So everyone who works there thinks it's ugly. Yep. Nobody's had a nice thing to say about it. Just when you thought we got rid of Magic Mountain, we've got the law courts. Kind of looks a bit like a funnel wearing pyjamas. What's this Lego shit? It's disgusting. It's just an absolute abortion. Just exactly what football team is this building going for? If this building is sitting on the fence, then what side of the law is it sitting on? Well, we actually all thought that that was the primer and they just forgot to actually paint it. You have one huge cone piece and it just sticks right out like dog's balls. Is this supposed to be sort of like a, a Rubik's Cube? Is it trying to tell us that it's, life is a puzzle and that we can't sort out our own problems, that it's a mystery, that we need their help? So what do you think of the law courts? So do you think the fact there's a cone there is trying to suggest that South Australians are a bunch of dope smokers? Well, especially coming from the Commonwealth Law Court building, I think it's a bit of an in-your-face type, well, you just can't have it, really, but we're going to put it in your face anyway. Come on, big brother. Adelaide wants to know why you've done this to us. We also want to know why the eviction took an hour later than usual. Come on, the text messages. How hard can it be? They are horrible. The only trial in that building is the trial of looking at it. Ugly. Mm -mm. It's obviously John Howard's gift to South Australia. <laughs>